Wow, wow, wow. Hello, everyone. Hello, the world out there. This is uh, Tan from Australia here. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for tuning in into this amazing video. Uh, even I'm making so many videos in the past already, but uh, people are still asking, you know, still having this same problem. How can we log in into our accounts? And we have problems to log in into our account and so on. So what I do today, I will share you another brand new video, show you step by step how you can recover uh, or your, your, your accounts, uh, how you can log into your account, how to reset your password and so on, okay? Even if someone would like to creating your 2FA, I will show you how to do the 2FA also in this short video, okay? And I always pick the first part is in English, and then the second part will be in Vietnamese uh, for all our Vietnamese people also. Okay, so thank you very much, uh, ladies and gentlemen. I will uh, share the screen. I will show you uh, step by step, okay, how to log in into the accounts. Uh, if you need to contact me, there's uh, also QR code here for Facebook, WhatsApp, and WeChat. You can connect me or you can go into Tan OC uh, YouTube channel and subscribe to the channel. So every video or brand new video that are loading, they will be automatically um, telling you so you can come and watch the video, ladies and gentlemen. All right, so let's move. Uh, I will show you step by step. First of all, when you uh, open your, um, your internet browser, uh, I guess we need to clean up your cookie first. Um, Sometimes, you know, uh, the cookie leading uh, to a, the, a different direction and they oh, sometimes it can be causing a little bit of a problem when you are locking. So um, to clean the cookie, you need to click here. This is on the, the, the padlock, okay? On the padlock here, you click in there, they should come up with this window. Okay, from this window, small window, you click on the cookie, okay, in here. And from this cookie, when you click it, they come up with another window like this, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, from this window, you click here, or, or whatever that you want to clean. Okay, for me, I'll clean everything, and, and they start again. Okay, and then you click remove. After remove, you click done, then it's okay, it's all good. So that's simple, easy how you clean your cookie okay after that now let's go into the system let's see we can uh, uh trying to log in into the account first of all using your internet browser on the top okay go back to your internet on the top you type in this okay uh you can type www one ecosystem.eu but it's on the browser on the top not just go to uh, the, the the google search and type it there it's complicated just go straight on the top the where the address bar the address browser and type up this um this address in there and then when you got into the address normally people are uh, click on the login because they see the login on the right hand side we're so excited okay yes i think i think uh the the um let me see if i can stop this so you can see here we go see on the top hand side you might see the login and say oh here we go just go here and log in uh right yes yes no ladies and gentlemen no 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 don't don't talk the, the click, click in there and log in. But what you need to do, ladies and gentlemen, what you need to do is here. You need to uh, click in here. In the ecosystem, you click the One Life Network. Okay. So when you click on the One Life Network, they bring you to the page like this, ladies and gentlemen. And in this page, you whether can choose to log in to click on the sign, or if you haven't been logging into the system for so long, what you need to do is to reset your password. So here, this is the step. I'll show you how to reset your password first, and then we come to the login later, okay? All right, so to reset the password, you need to click on the forgot 
password. Okay, click on the forgot password. They will bring you to the next page like this, ladies and gentlemen. On the next page, you need to insert your email address in there, in that box. After click the uh, insert all the email, the correct email that you use in the One Ecosystem, the One Life previous um, platform. Now you click the submit. When you click the submit, you should receive this, ladies and gentlemen, this message saying that, uh, asking you to go and check your email. Okay. So now you go into your email address. The next step, go into your email address and check your email. You should receive the email like this, ladies and gentlemen. On, on the email, they actually have the button that called confirm. Right. So you need to click there to confirm that this is your email address. Ah, right. Remember this. When you click in there, they bring you to the page like this, ladies and gentlemen. On this page, you need to put in your email address and you also need to create in your new password. And remember, in this email or in this password, as you say, in the password, they have to be mixture of words number and a simple like a dollar sign or the app sign or whatever sign you need to put it there okay a mixture of three so normally you need one capital words okay and the mixture of number and 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 words and also the dollar sign or the app sign the simple after that ladies and gentlemen okay repeat those password on the top here, whatever you write on the top, repeat it again in the second box. When you got uh, all done, click on reset. And yes, done. That will bring you to the 2FA page. So you already log in, but you are in your 2FA page. In term, if you don't want to too much trouble, you can close this page and then we log in. You can get into the One Ecosystem accounts. Right, we repeat the login. Okay, if not, if you want to reset the 2FA, this is the step how you can reset the 2FA or you set up the two factor authentication for the security of your accounts. Okay, so to do that, you click on the two factor authentication. In there, okay, when you click there, they should bring you to the page like this. Ah, okay. In this page, you need to click Add Authenticator App. Okay. So when you start doing this, you have to have your phone with you or the, the device that where you have the, uh, you install the 2FA. Okay. In your phone, maybe your iPhone, you need to go to the, the 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 app store and download this app in there okay this app the authenticator app right you download that app into your phone open the phone using this to scan in okay scan this qr code so when you scan the qr code your phone should show the 2FA number and this number keep changing every single 30 seconds something like that 30 or 15 seconds they keep changing okay they keep changing but you need to insert this number in here and then you need to click verify so once that is done that's it you're already creating your 2FA however now you now they bring you to this page, okay? So you can disable it whenever you don't need it. You can disable it, but you need to have the uh, the recover code, ladies and gentlemen. You need to have a recover code because what happened? Sometimes you change the device or something, you need to reset it again. They need the recovery code. Okay, so you need to click in here, reset recovery code, okay, and then there will be 
come to this like this this page so from this page you click on generate recovery code they should come with 10 codes in here you need to copy this code keep somewhere saved okay uh, and and later one of those 10 that you will be used to reset your 2FA again. Keep it in the safe for your future use, right? So when you set up this 2FA, remember to get this code and put it in somewhere safe, all right? Otherwise, later you can't log in, too much trouble and so on because it's too much security and only you can be fixed. Otherwise, you have to send to the company and they might get charged for this, okay? So I want to make it very clear for everyone, you need to generate this, okay? And yes, let watch the video again and again. If you actually miss the step, you can watch this video again, okay? Now, congratulations, you are done. Now, you can log in to your account again by very easy, simple step, go into the oneecosystem.eu again. They come up with this picture. Remember, click on the uh, the uh, the ecosystem, the one line. They come to this page. From this page, you just put in your 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 username. But in now, your username is the email address. Oh, so insert your email address and then your new password. Okay. Insert your new password in and then click the sign in. All right. So if you already reset your or set up your um your 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 two FA, now they're asking you to insert the two FA number in the box and then you click login. That's it. Congratulations, you are logged in to your account. And you will see something like this from your dashboard. All right. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, you can see now in the list, if you have multiple accounts, you click on this arrow going down, you will see the list of all your accounts in there. You can pick and choose and swap from one account to a different account to check your One Life accounts there, ladies and gentlemen. All right. You also can see if you are actually click on your My Profile, and here, you also can see how many accounts you have in here also, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so that's done. That's easy, step by step, how you can log into your account. However, for someone who try everything from this uh, um, video from top to bottom, and you still not sure how to log in. So this is the next step. Um, uh, for you, uh, if you try everything but it still not work, uh, it's come up with the message, ah, you uh, you can't find a user or user does not exist or whatever, yeah? So you, what, what the next step you need to do? So what happened, ladies and gentlemen, you need to send an email to support at oneecosystem.eu. That is the email here, okay? And then you tell them clearly the title, what? is the problem so this is the locking issue okay so and in, you also need to tell them uh, more in detail okay so you can write dear support uh, yes and today i'm writing to asking for help in regard to my one ecosystem account i can't log in okay uh, or, or whatever okay your reason to be there give them your username for example, ABC coins, okay? And then your email address is like abc at gmail.com. Let them know your email. And then uh, just uh, a few words, let them know, you know, appreciate their work and so on. So once you got all this done, you click on send. When your email is sent, they should have an automatic re reply email to your email address, okay? They say it very clearly, okay? With this email, they also give you a ticket number there also, right? All right. So waiting for a while, you might receive more response from the company 
okay uh, for example like this okay the, the reply email send it to your email address abc at gmail.com and then they tell you what the problem okay so in this current situation they say in the current system we have merged the respective account into one single profile and through this profile you have access to each of your accounts and can switch from one to another freely without the need of lockout, lock-in each time, okay? This creates a certain rule regards to the usage of your email currently. There can be only one profile with each email, okay? So, however, there are multiple profiles with the same email address and different phone number used by multiple people for more than one profile. In order you to reset your password, each profile must hold a unique email and all profiles that have duplicate email must be changed. All right. So they tell you all the problem, what you need to do and everything. And then what happened? Because of a lot of work there that need to be checked and so on. That's why company have a charge. Okay. They charge here, 30 euro. There is a fee for to pay 30 euro. Where you need to pay it? Yeah, here, the company will give you also their address, their, um, their, their digital wallet address, okay? So you need to uh, send the money to the wallet from the email that they reply to you, okay? Don't just send to here, okay? This is every people that might be have a, a, a different uh, address or so on um, during time. So don't just send to this address, but wait for the email they send it to your email they respond to your email then of course you need to send it to them okay or respond or read the email okay and then respond to that then your account can be fixed i know it's a little bit complicated um, if this is the first time but ladies and gentlemen day after day you know, we do a few times you will get used to it and then you can also able you also able to support your team and help your team also ladies and gentlemen if you are know everything then of course you can help your team to build up also and and support them to fix the account don't just wait for uh, a leader to do it but you need to learn learn and then you can help the team you can help the team and get the team to uh, start to um, to learn also and then they can log into the account and the team can helping their team and so on by that duplication the system will work in well so good luck ladies and gentlemen that is the part in english uh, for everyone you know, how to log into the account and so on okay thank you so much uh, i think i will end this i will make another video in vietnamese uh, separately so make it easy for everyone then okay thank you so much Take care and uh, wish you all the best. You can log into your account so you can enjoy a lot of usability in this sector. Please share this video around and also subscribe to our YouTube channel, uh, Tan OC. Okay, you can see Tan OC there. Okay, thank you guys. See you then.